everyone welcome to k news 24 7 my name is cameron i have opis my co-host we are discussing everything that is happening at naturena good evening i'm happy right one ah sweet uh, remember before that incident of O'Brien peterson yelling at the coach we didn't know what was going on because big nana sound so a footage without the sound you can't tell yeah. what is going on actually so now a statement came uh, they are giving us a clarity with what really happened actually so only to find out what O'Brien peterson was not yelling at the coach Ugu kevin johnson mm. but he was complaining about uh, a performance about when he was not happy with how uh, they handled the game yes. because we, we we almost lost uh, won that uh, match against Orlando Pirates actually i thought that it's a win for us i don't know what to see lose game that's why we saw uh, open peterson frustrated so they say what you know uh, beganga kal beganga kal in coach he was angry of uh, the players how they handled the game he was disappointed because he expected which case the Chiefs will win Isoweto Derby this time around. So he apologized to the rest of the team. Uh, suspend one, no suspension, no nothing, but he just apologized Ngadewi uh, Aipatenga Corner in public because he ruined the image of the club yeah. Ikeza Chiefs and also Kevin Johnson is Tunzisak. Because we, we thought Oguti Lendole between Yena no coach Kevin Johnson. Yeah, by the look of things, uh yeah, sure good to be young Russell coach. Um but my mom what you IPX is a foot that video clip uh um the body language uh, coach. You know the way Abu Gakon it didn't look like he was too much concerned because even after U uh, Uprenden I said to him shout he he gave him a pet on the back. So with this statement as Pumile I think for me I I can accept that with you well he wasn't shouting at the coach but rather he was shouting at the performance of his of his teammates. So <clears throat> maybe it's something you would you know it there's that passion and that willingness to win the game. So obviously maybe he was caught on the road on the wrong side of things and by the time a cool man a coach camera was on to him so obviously in jungle but if there's no sound everyone will make their own assumptions yeah, yeah i understand uh, now, russell coach Chetis coach and things like that so yeah i'm just happy because uh being a russell coach because i had a different vision manch about <laughs> case Chiefs players who took sugar they are disrespectful to yeah. their coach and yeah. they, they they don't see the coach the existence of the coach so i'm happy uh, let's hope now they, they are not telling us what they want us to know let's hope yeah, they are telling yeah. us the truth because you know it's yeah, very good at switching the story we understand yeah. when it comes to your to, yeah. to your ears so you believe we understand yes so there's a coach also Lan. you know uh, we will we'll always talk about coaches in almost all our videos yes. because we are not happy with the current coaching that is there at natural a bit to look a email look email which wins all and with this coach what's up <laughs> uh the famous look email this guy was uh once a coach of resistors back when steve compeller was our coach here at kiza chiefs um she's um well he's a he's a character and yeah, nah. he's uh we coach right but then i'm funny so no no penny market the way uh, i character a corner or on the touchline and doing his coaching yeah he has since spoken good night we forget the cv and actually uh just when they fired to move in take or to me like bob him down and has been since waiting who's a good good can't matter what i want i'm available here's my cv but he said uh, they didn't respond to him. So by the looks of things, Gash and Jogutai, he management achieves him shy sang more. But um, even if I'm shy sang more, I don't blame him management achieves because 
coach Luke Aimel has always been a controversial character. I think for a team of Kaiser Chiefs cal- caliber, I don't think Oguti um, he will fit there. Guna Churena. So you, you, am I, am I, am I trapped or coach up before? He has ETSTV Premiership experience, or he has coached the first stars here at home. He 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 went abroad to coach another club in Africa. He was banned to play a club for he 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 used the Marisi's remarks, and then he came back here, and then he was um bagay ba 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 mians ela in They don't want they don't want him to coach back here on Zanz. Um, I, I don't know which is Sapphire Pele laughing at another thing because they said he's he's kind of a racist coach. I still remember he once fought with U coach Steve Compel. Uh, first Stars went into the final of the, um, the final of the NetBank Cup at the expense of Kaiser Chiefs by losing two not. And I, I think that was the the game whereby Steve Compel was chased by fans. Uh, Lee Moses Mapida Stadium, and then he said, "Yeah, no, uh, he's better than some other coaches. Some coaches don't even have a trophy, but they are coaching a big team." He was referring to Steve Compella. So, just by that, I don't think uh, the Kaiser Chiefs management will consider him. But guy, you know, put me live with time in to Mel CV. I'm available. I'm waiting on them. But hey, yeah, talking about uh, him uh, being banned, Nalaim Zansi. Yes. You, you can see with his reputation, he don't have a a, a, a green reputation. Bit. Exactly. I understand. So hey, for the image of a club that is big like Kaiser Chiefs, they can lose a respect to the club. Le or Kolumanga, he was uh, being racist. You understand? Exactly. So come on, uh, I don't blame the management not to reply back to him. Definitely, a uh, profile I can fit. It is not in previous. Now, Konanji, who coached Justin Platinum? He coached Free State Stars. Free State Stars. So, yes, come on. He back as a coach in Bulgana City. That's why Safa <coughs> wanted to intervene with No. We can't have a coach, a pressure from another country here in Africa by calling some people monkeys and then Tina in South Africa. We accept him back. So just by that, uh, I don't think which Chiefs will really consider his his offer. Mm, yeah, perfect. I think uh, this is it. I think this is it. Uh, thank you so much for watching. What are you saying about Oprin and Peterson? Because this ever is suspension, as Nje Sboni Lutu Melenkune once got suspended. Um, Tanzania was got uh, suspended. What are you saying about Brennan Peterson? Is it a good thing? Let us know in the comment section below. And also, what are you saying about Yenage who look uh, email submitting a CV to Kaiser Chiefs? If you know something about this coach, just let us know in the comment section below about him. Guys, this is it. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you next time with something else.